Okay, so today we're gonna be working on the bumper. As you guys can see, I already got started on it. I kind of uh, plastic welded most of the stuff together. So now what we'll have to do is probably sand it down. And I do have the plastic filler, so I should be able to fill it up and get it all nice and smooth, unlike how it is now. And what I'll do is I'll set you guys on a time loop and hopefully by the end of the day we can have this thing straightened out similar to how it is on the other side. So just got done putting the epoxy on there. I know it looks kind of rough right now, but we're gonna be able to sand it out and make it all smooth. This is what I use, it's a multi-purpose uh, repair material or whatever, it's about 3M, that's the part of code. According to this thing, it should be sandable in about 15 minutes, but I'm gonna give it about 30 minutes or so just so it can fully cure. Other than that, let's see here, that part is done. All right, so I just got done with the bumper. Just sanded it down and everything looks nice and straight. All the pieces, all the body lines are right there. Uh, only thing left to do is uh, primer it and paint. And we should be ready to go. But I won't be doing that today. It's starting to rain a little bit and I'm not trying to do it anymore. And we did get some new packages in. This kind of looks like the fender. the headlight that just came in. So here's the new headlight that just came in. This is the old one. It looks in great shape. The only thing is it doesn't come with any of the hardware. So the bulbs, the ballast, or any of the other, these little heat sinks or whatever they are. So I'm be going ahead and uh, transferring over to the new one. So let's get to it. <laughs> 